I'm I'm the opposite. I don't I'm not into the Brazilians and mm. but I'm, you I'm not braid into that. I do. Benny and Betty. Uh, yes, I do. I do. <laughs> straight I do. back. I, yes, I straight do. Up, yes, twist. I, I, all of that. Dibrets. All, I'm just all of the above. <laughs> like from number four, number one, all yeah. of that. You know. Yeah. However, yeah. insecurity comes from when I don't know how to do like correct makeup. I don't know how to do. You know. Baby. The, um, I don't know how to do any of that, and because I don't, you know, it's like, girl, what's why? Ooh. Why you? Oh my goodness! You need to get with the. People. Hello ladies and Bonani and welcome to Anshente. I am Theo Chaga and I will be part of the group that is discussing something very interesting. Uh, <laughs> before we get to it, let they introduce themselves from the lady to the last gent. <laughs> Hi, I'm fortunate. Hello guys, I'm Wanshen, the guy behind the channel. Hopefully you will enjoy and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's grow the channel. Yay! I'm do me. Mm-hmm. Yes. yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Still trying to wrap my head around that name. <laughs> you know, like it's a, it's a it's a it's a prototype of some name. <laughs> some name. So w today we're talking about insecurities in women that men don't really yeah. Yeah. worry too much about. Yeah. As long as the man loves you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're like, you know what? I'm cool with that. I'm 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 cool. Why why cry? Why war? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna be discussing them and we hope that you can also drop your comment below and subscribe to the page and like the page if you do not i will contact the police <laughs> uh, now let's get into it uh the first one skin color mm. somebody care to share and explain to us can i take it oh, yeah, yeah, yeah you can you can you're more than welcome oh i think most ladies really are insecure when it comes to their pigmentation that's why there's bleaching yeah mm -hmm. that's, that's why there's popular. bleaching and it's doing real harm when it comes to our african queens yeah mm -hmm. uh, and that's... then i believe that if a man really loves you they wouldn't care if you are dark or you are light or you are what just yeah. accept yourself the way you are and rock your skin man, yes. the way it is mm -hmm. because those bleaches have long-term side effects if you're doing bleach it's your skin, it's good for you, but always saying that people must accept you the way you are. Yeah. Yeah, that's nah, what yeah. I might take. All right. Well, Do you want to add on that? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay. Well, 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 I feel I feel like for women, this whole skin color thing, it's, it's everywhere. You mm -hmm. understand? Because mm -hmm. even makeup makes you lighter. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, once you put makeup on, you just want to be that lighter. Even if you're dark. When you put makeup on, you just wanna be. You don't wanna be dark. Cause that's a Vaseline. Yeah. You won't just like wanna decide to cause I'm dark. Just gonna Vaseline my whole body. Yeah. And all that mm. You don't do that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It's gotten to the point where you know, women even put makeup on their hands and like yeah. everywhere yeah. just to yeah, to, to match. Yeah. Yeah. And then, and then you get this chick maybe from Felicia Sanyama. She was light yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> this morning. This morning, she mm. she she's like, "Hello, so, I'm an African queen." <laughs> Something else. Yeah. And then there was yeah. there was you thinking that you got the the brightest star. You know, and nope. you really don't. <laughs> yeah. You know. Yeah, but from from a lady's perspective, I think that quickly. Um, you know, it's it's really societal standards that influence women to be mm. secure about the skin true. color. True. Very true. Um, because what society says is beautiful is light skin you know because you guys can talk about this whole bleaching whatnot but mm. you still sometimes just no. you know pass by our darker skin sisters i i you, know, you make fun yeah. of them you know you Do clown we? them <laughs> they've been bullied things mm -hmm. like that so mm -hmm. hence they become insecure because insecurities don't just come out of nowhere yeah. you know hence they are insecure about the uh, pigmentation and they decide uh, to lighten the skin color. true mm -hmm. it's worse when they are being bullied by the same people from the same gender yeah that's worse. that's worse but let's move on to number two then straight into it body shape mm. who has to take it i believe the man far to my right would like to take it <laughs> body shape oh, body shape yeah. yep i think i think men have a certain idea of how they want the woman to be yeah we were talking about this before we did the podcast mm. um men see as flat stomach big curves big but mm. as oh my god ideal ideal, ideal yeah. true mm. you know what i'm saying but then is it really ideal mm. 
is is it is it really 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 ideal because at the same time when you're with her it's not about the curves mm. it's not about her boobs it's not about anything else Thank it, you. it's just nice to to be working with her yeah guys. you know what yeah. i'm saying it's nice to 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 for your friends to say ah she's that. oh my god yeah. you got the you yeah. my god her body Kim Kardashian mm. okay. you know what i'm saying and then and then when it comes to you being at home with her mm -hmm. and you find out that it's like why mm -hmm. <laughs> there is no it, it's even worse when you find a bimbo mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. that type of body yeah like you only go for the body but then She's a bimbo. Character wise, she's <laughs> character wise, she's personality. Personality wise, she's not intellectually. But how did she get home before you found out she was a bimbo? Before you found out she didn't have any personality? Because and those things shouldn't you establish those things first before she do, gets do, home? Do 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 men really do that? Do we do we actually? Do you? We, most men don't. Most men don't. Uh, can, I say, men... can I say something? Just uh, one minute. Like I think nope. uh, thirty seconds is <laughs> well. We love for thirty seconds. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. I think men for for the for for the duration of their play, like when they play, they like those women to show off. Mm -hmm. But when they want to settle, they really go for the personality, the character, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. the intellect, not mm -hmm. for the looks. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's I, what think, I, hate I, to th say. I think that's true. Yeah, I, yeah. Think, I, th I think that's very. That true. could be very true at the end of the day, but at the end of the actual day, it's all about preference. <laughs> it's all about preference. It's all about preference. We're different, and we like different things. Now yeah, let's definitely. move on to number three: teeth. Mm. Teeth. I think. I think. <laughs> Let her take. Were you smiling? Yeah, <laughs> just showcasing. Showing your, your showcasing. Okay, uh, okay. What you have to say? Um, I, 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 I'm not into giving my teeth. Actually, I'm like, I, I think I have a straight set of teeth. Mm. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't, I don't, I, I, I can't relate. If there are any insecurities about teeth, I really can't relate. Oh, right. Well, 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 there, there are insecurities. But, but we, we, ju we just say thank God for Corona, mm -hmm. not not thank God for Corona. Wait, so you can mask up? <laughs> yeah, yeah, mask up. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that, that that's that escalated. That's a bit like quick. <laughs> extreme. Man. It's, it's, like, quick. it's like oh my God, I'm zero yeah, to yeah, You know what I'm saying? Like like you get to talk to a honey, maybe you meet up wherever, mm -hmm. and she's all masked up, masked okay. up and. You know, you're vibing, you're having so much fun, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Until there comes a point where you have to get out of the shop. Yeah. You have to get into the car. Okay, she's still maxed up and, and all that type of ish. But you can't kiss with a mask. Mm. <laughs> Why do you have to kiss in Corona? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> no it happens. <laughs> President said it, no kissing. Uh, let, let's move on to number four, right? The mm. hair. Mm. Oh, the hair has been an issue for the longest time. That's why we have Brazilian hair. Mm -hmm. That's why we have like all these other things. But again, I feel like sometimes it's not an insecurity thing. It's just to enhance beauty. Mm. Yeah, just like makeup. Just like makeup, just to enhance the beauty. Mm, 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 mm. And and often we need that. I mean, uh, can I just say something? Okay. I think the insecurity sometimes, I'll say for me, Personal. Uh, yeah, um, <clears throat> it's I'm I'm the opposite. I don't I'm not into really Brazilians. And, mm -hmm. But you, I'm, don't I'm not you braid? I do. Benny and Betty. Uh, yes, I do. I do. <laughs> straight I do. back. I, yes, I straight do. Up, yes, twist. I, I, all of that. Dibrets. All, I'm just all of the above. <laughs> like from number four, number one, all of that. You know. <laughs> However, yeah. the insecurity comes from when I don't know how to do like correct makeup. I don't know how to do, you know, Baby, the, yeah. um, I don't know how to do any of that. And because I don't, you know, it's like, girl, what's why? Mm. Why are you? Oh my goodness, you need to get with the times, mm. you know. And it's like, yeah. but I'm not really into that. Like, mm. I, I think it looks beautiful. I think when women do it, it's gorgeous. Like y'all yeah. are rocking it. Like keep doing it. But it's just not for me. Yeah. And uh, so my insecurity is that I'm not with it. And, oh. People right. think it's weird. it's weird. As much as yeah. that is an insecurity, I feel like personally, um, most women or everybody generally, when it comes to the hair, you need to understand what suits you. Mm -hmm. What suits you best. Mm -hmm. yeah. Some people look good with short hair, like just a simple short hair, mm -hmm. nothing. They just look amazing. Mm -hmm. And there's people that look amazing in Benny and Betty. And right now, because we're getting with the times, there's girls that literally do a Benny and Betty and a young baby hair, and you're like, ooh. 
I did not know Benny and Betty could get there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, <laughs> so like we we we're literally moving right. with the times. So like you you just you just gotta figure out what you, you can take and mix and make it work. Mm-hmm. You yeah. don't need to buy an expensive weave or mm-hmm. or hair piece. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You just gotta yeah. think about what works for what you, works for you. Yeah. as a person. Don't but be insecure definitely. about you. Equally for me as a woman, what works for me doesn't work for men. Like because I'm into natural hair, does that make me more appealing to men? There's, Some men there's someone who will find the, you very attractive you know, with Brazilian. your natural. Mm-hmm. There, there's men that say I like the natural man. They amazing. And this guy's like, you know what? A little bit of weave would do. <laughs> like it's it's a preference thing. Yeah, it's a preference so we shouldn't thing. be trying to cater to the whole world. But you you should know that there's a certain market for everything. Yeah. Mm, there okay. is, there is, there's people that but really I, I think this is things. deeper than we think. I think it's a question of how God really created us as a race. It goes mm-hmm. deep deeper than what we think because I think we're analyzing it on a shallow level. Mm-hmm. In, what Afro, sense, in African. a sense that your 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 African hair, they don't appreciate it. They would rather cover exactly. it up with something else, Brazilian. Yes. Caucasian Caucasian or Asian hair so is this really a question of not appreciating your natural uh, attributes as an African woman or what is it that's why I said I believe sometimes it's a thing of trying to enhance because because you know you can rock your natural every day Mm -hmm. but just like so what can I add which spice can I put on to to this look that I already have But right it, it has That's gone to a level where people weaves. now, they look down to those who don't draw exactly. them. Exactly. Right? So you that wonder if it's a question of enhancing yes. or it's a question of uh, not admiring your natural. Dismissing. Yeah. True. Yeah, exactly. So now we leave the ball in your hands. You can drop your comment below and tell us what you think of that question. Now moving along. Mm. Number five. Oh. Small slash big. Boobies. <laughs> yep. Small boobies. We've seen. No, no, I didn't say that. You, huh? Okay. Boobies. Boobies. Yes. Boobies. Yes. Boobies. Yes. Yeah, so like breasts. Yes. Oh, yes. Boobies. So oh, like this, boobies. this, this girls yeah. that are very um, insecure about having small uh, or big. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. We we still try to find the line of normality in that we're still trying to make it feel like yo oh, mm. everything you got is okay mm. so what, what is it but is. i wish we can have ladies talking about she's it. here I, she can yeah, take exactly. all of them <laughs> <laughs> say something I, um i think that especially when it comes to breasts mm. it's it's really it kind of changes mm. you know the, the norm really changes because at first it's like well no you know small boobs mm. good they're great and then if when they're like there's a normal size like the middle size and then when it's like big it's like too big mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you know and i think the insecurity for women also becomes with clothing mm-hmm. you know because there's some clothes that look better when you have small boobs yeah and when you have bigger boobs you know there's some things that are just you know, mm-hmm. they're not very flattering mm-hmm. and i remember actually this happened when i was younger in high school because in primary school actually because oh, oh, I started my boobs <laughs> my boobs started growing earlier than my friends mm-hmm. okay. and it was so hard for me to get the right size bra mm-hmm. that read I remember crying in the store mm-hmm. with my mom because I couldn't I was big uh, my bra size wasn't there oh. because, so I was crying because mm-hmm. all the like with all the bras I didn't have a bra size and it, it was just so difficult because it's like why why can't i find the right mm, bra the for me mm. exactly you know if it's if the bra is either too big or too small mm-hmm. you know um and that is just it's, it, it causes a lot of discomfort yeah. mm-hmm. so i think a lot of insecurities for that is not necessarily from men mm-hmm. unless well, wait, once you get older but when you're younger is really for you like body image mm-hmm. you know fitting in with your friends when you're the first one with big boobs and your friends don't got no boobs mm-hmm. you are just like mm. that's wrong yeah mm-hmm. exactly exactly yeah. and then they also project that insecurities onto you so uh, it's like true. your boobs are big because uh, they don't have any boobs yeah. and it's like no the, my boobs are not big you yeah, guys okay. just don't have boobs uh, <laughs> but know? what do you make of those who are old they don't they have small boobs right mm-hmm. and they put they put in stuffs to kind of augment yeah, well, 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 well well uh, i was about to talk about that you know what mm-hmm. i'm saying that men have we we actually have some of us some of us have this perfect idea of 
what pe- pe- perfect boobs are. Mm. Like mm. for for some women, it's nice to sit in a bra. Yeah, mm. <laughs> it's very nice to like you see the cleavage and all that type of edge. But when you get home, and she takes off the bra, and they're like, ah, okay. <laughs> you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then you set you certainly change your your whole perspective yeah. of everything. Yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying? They look good in a bra. <laughs> mm. Until she took off the bra. Yeah. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then Eva, another thing. Mm. On its There's own. this thing, they rock uh, a, a, a dress without a bra. It's also like yeah. the they just leave them dangling. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I still need to call K Naomi on that one. I, I don't know what they call it. What do they call it? Push a bra. Huh? Push a bra. Okay. I'm not sure if that's what you're referring to, but there are certain. They don't bras wear bra. How like w- w- when when you wear a blazer and mm-hmm. you don't have a bra right. underneath, what do we call that? Yeah. Oh, but are they like sticky? Also, that's is it something that they put? Do they put? They put nothing. They put nothing. It's just, just, nothing. Like, it's just it's a blazer. Just like and a blazer and and, 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 and there's no there's no bra underneath. You've never seen I'm, that. You've never seen anyone they, do that. No, they do that. I'm not familiar. Oh, you should watch TV more. I'm not. I'm not familiar with that. But I think read magazines. Lifestyle magazine. In, in all fairness, guys, I think that as men, you need to be open-minded. Mm-hmm. There's not as women, we don't progress the same. Yeah. We have different body types, mm-hmm. different genes. There's some women who really, literally, have genetic problems. Like yeah. they, it's they're not. It's not because you know it's just a thing. Like they true. really don't develop. Yeah. So I think that men should be more sensitive to that and more educated about. Very that. true to that. Now let's mm-hmm. wrap it up with this one. Now, um, I, I don't know why most women have insecurities when it comes to this one uh, specifically uh our race type of women mm. when you have a flat behind is that a big insecurity it is okay oh. tell us why it is why is it an insecurity <laughs> this i need to hear yeah. well, i think i need to as, hear as a, as a uh, modern woman yeah you can't deny the fact that that is the standard today of beauty as a woman oh. um, as far as the ideal a woman having an ideal body yeah you need to have a little behind yeah. you know what I mean and by a little I don't mean like you know Kim Kardashian or, or, I mean a big behind not Kim Kardashian or Nicki Minaj or anything like okay. that but just just a little something <laughs> just a something little to something. grab for me. You know, yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> equally, it's historically as black women, we are known for car curves. We are known oh, for so it's, having it's a natural. It's, thing. it's a natural attribute. I mean, this is what we are known for. Like it's, it's. Mm. It, it, I mean, it's sad because mm. today we are being obje- objectified, objectified. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because of it. Um, it's however, sad. that's just that's how that's our natural makeup. But mm-hmm. obviously, you have a few of us like myself who are not as gifted, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. and that's okay. Like I guess. That's okay. <laughs> no, I'm, listen, I'm, I'm, that's the reality. Be proud. I'm, be proud. Yeah. yeah. Be proud. Listen, be it's, it's unfortunate for me In whenever Bogota. I want to like wear something and I'm like, oh, I wish I could have a little bit like, True. Boost. Yeah. You yeah, are you so, insecure? Like, are you insecure the, though? No. Like, no, I've accepted it. I've accepted it. Are you guys it. aware that almost everything that we covered on today's list? is out there and it's artificially made right now. Mm. So yeah, like, yeah, yeah, there's people that are artificially doing almost everything that we just spoke about. Yeah, yeah, if they we, don't yeah. feel okay with it, they just go to the doctor, Dr. Miami, mm. Dr. Whoever. Mm, mm, so, mm, mm, so I mean, as much as I don't know whether it's scientists coming up with a solution to insecurities mm, or what, mm, but it's we live in, in a time and an era, if you don't got it, you just go get it. It's like you can buy it now. Mm. Well, well, guys, when yeah. it comes to this, um, it, it becomes two ways, right? Mm. You have society. Society says a flat ass is sexy. Mm. Okay. <laughs> you, you know what I'm saying? You you like I seen this in movies, and then and then this guy would be like, oh, is it low shedding? Yeah, it's, it's load shedding. Load shedding on the okay. show. <laughs> Thank you, Esco. That's how we wrap very today's much. episode. <laughs> <laughs> I hope we can still see us. Uh, thank you very much for joining us. <laughs> Subscribe, like. Uh, we live in a planet whereby load shedding happens every day. Thank you, Esco. Uh, it once happened on TV. <laughs> so just look out for that. Yeah, More yeah, of yeah. your videos coming up. Subscribe, like the page. I'm Theo Chaka. She is fortunate. I'm one shunt. Do me. Do me.